Good morning, everyone. I'm so sick. Can you tell that I'm sick? We went to Clemson this past weekend to visit my brother and it was so much fun. We had the best weekend ever. It was a lot of fun seeing Jackson and just feeling the college life, experiencing the college life and seeing his apartment and meeting his friends and everything. But on Saturday, it was a homecoming game and on the morning of Saturday, <laughs> I woke up and I just knew I, I was getting sick. I could feel that I was getting sick. But I rallied through the weekend because I didn't want to ruin the weekend, but I'm definitely sick. But we had a great weekend. So without further ado, I'll do a little recap of what I got on the weekend because I tried to film the weekend and I did, but then when I got sick, I got kind of over filming because I just didn't feel very well. So let's see what I got. We made it to Atlanta. We are in Georgia and we are supposed to drive from here to Clemson to visit my brother. There's been a little bit of an issue with finding a car because the lady dropped it off in the wrong place and now we're in a lawsuit, so. But all is well. We made it here safely, so that's all that matters. I guess I gotta get one drink. So as you can see, we are here in South Carolina. We're visiting Jackson, and we're at this little backyard. What's this called? Pigs in a blanket. And <laughs> we're at a little event. <laughs> These are Jackson's roommates. They are extremely tall. This one's at least seven foot. Look at Dylan. I think he's literally seven feet tall. So here we are at the, um, wait, let's see what it's called. Smoking <laughs> pig. <laughs> We're the smoking pig. It's very, very, very good food. Super fun vibe. We have cornhole over here. We've got a little petting green. We have this cool area over here. Uh, this is a mellow night, but um, if you're here on a Friday for a football game, let me tell you, this place is oh. like, woo, going off. <laughs> but we're having a good time. We just got in from California, and here we are. We just ate dinner, and now we're playing a little cornhole. Woohoo! It also happens to be me and Dylan's four-year anniversary. Happy anniversary. 48. What? 48 months. <laughs> okay, everyone, we are out at Roar Roar <laughs> and shut it down. Shut it down. <laughs> Today is Friday. Last night we went to Jackson's apartment and then we went out on the town. And let me just say this, the difference between a 22 year old and a 25 year old is like the difference between a 22 year old and a 95 year old. I feel like the oldest lady in the world. Now this morning we switched hotels rooms. <laughs> we switched hotel rooms. Now, oh yeah, and then we went to breakfast. I forgot to show breakfast, but now this is a lot that my parents bought and they're gonna build a house. <laughs> yeah, I was just informed of that. Yeah, that's my dad hiking around. And there's a squirrel in the trees and there's acorns falling. And I'm a little scared that I'm gonna get hit like a monkey with a coconut. So I'm pretty much the worst videoer in the world. <laughs> we took a tour of this guy's house that he's custom building and now we're going, we're at the hotel, we went to our room and I changed and now we're going to my parents' hotel room. And then I don't know what we're doing but I'm kind of in the mood for a sandwich. I could really use some Jersey mics right now. So hopefully we'll be able to do something about that. Dylan's bringing his house. Welcome. Welcome to our school. Driving around, driving around. My mom and dad had to go to a meeting, so now Jackson is taking me to go get a sandwich. 
because I'm hungry. And Dylan's back here sleeping and it's very beautiful. We're in the forest. Isn't this from a movie, Calhoun? It sounds perfect. Yeah, isn't it? Dylan's mad that I said he was sleeping. <laughs> That a little more confused. Yeah. Like, okay, what? So then, what did you bring? I brought the drinks and the chips. Where are the drinks? The drinks and the chips are in the bag. Oh. Maybe he's in the bathroom. Maybe he's working there. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's 12:40. I woke up feeling ill, but okay. I'm in good spirits. Big Gucci 600 over there. Oh, we should look up who he is. Add him on Snapchat and send him a picture of him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We are on our way to Jackson's apartment and we're gonna eat our Jersey Mike's, my favorite restaurant in the whole wide world. And then we're gonna go to the tailgate and the football game. And this is my new sweatsh or no, my new shirt. It has this little clock on it that says Clemson. I'm wearing this slick back bun to show that I'm very mature. And sophisticated. And sophisticated. Yeah, sophisticated bridal bun. It's a, it's a wedding bun. <laughs> Just getting some practice in for when I do my hair and makeup on my but wedding I morning. Braid. Oh, and my mom has a braid. Which is like, I'm fun. And yeah, she's young and useful. I'm very perky. And she has her hoops in. <laughs> bigger hoops. the hoop, bigger the hoe. <laughs> <laughs> and, um. Is that a say? Yes, it is. Wow, the bigger the hoop, the so you're a big hoe. <laughs> <laughs> and Jackson over here, he's driving us all. He's our DD, as he's also hosting us. <laughs> and he's the DJ. And he's the DJ. DJ, DJ DD. Host, tour host, guy. And big hoe. Party planner. <laughs> Dylan is fully decked out in his school spirit. He loves Clemson. Oh, look at me. Okay, Dylan is looking at this. Had this open on his phone. What is it? Well, that's just a photo of this good, man. Well, <laughs> he's just been that's staring at him for a long time. Like him, but, but he's like 100 pounds heavier than the guy in that photo. Let's be Maybe he's in a fraternity. I, he looks like 35 years old. <laughs> <laughs> we're at the tailgate now. Go Clemson! We were at a different tailgate that was a frat, and now we're at a real estate brokerage. <laughs> And Dylan's eating the chicken, and yeah. I just ate a cherry that was moonshine infused. It was very, very disgusting. My best score so far is uh, right now. to my parents and especially thank you Jackson for making that such a great weekend. But now today's Tuesday, we're back at home and Dylan's at work so I'm gonna have to fend for myself today. I am the worst sick person ever because when I get sick, I get really sick. I'm not just like, like Dylan when he gets sick, He's sick for like 45 minutes and then he's better. I'm sick for like 45 days and I feel awful the whole time, so. But I think I'm gonna make a smoothie 
take some medicine and take a bath that I feel like will probably make me feel better, hopefully. We picked up Rocky last night from Dylan's dad's house. It's so good to see him. I missed him very much. And I think that he missed us too. So I ordered these shelves a while ago. They came literally the day that we left. So we had our neighbors get our mail and stuff. So Dylan wanted to hang them up last night and I was really just wanting to get to bed, but. I helped them hang them, so they look pretty good. These are the shelves that we were talking about. And I'm not gonna show you, but I'm actually so excited about this. Our save the dates came super, super quickly. I don't wanna share exactly what I did, but I custom like did them, but I didn't pay, like I made them, but I paid for like a custom design and then I custom made them because custom Invitations are super expensive. I got a quote and it was like $1,500. And I get that invitations are expensive and you'd have to pay. Like I feel like for our wedding invitations, sky's the limit. <laughs> Not really, but our actual wedding invitations is one thing. Spending a lot of money on a wedding invitation is one thing, but our save the dates, I was like $1,500. I just thought that was ridiculous. This is what my bedside table looks like right now. We have some Theraflu, some cough drops, this stuff literally numbs your throat. Dylan gave me that. And my water. First things first, I'm gonna make my Theraflu. This is the like only stuff that I've really felt works for me when I'm sick. These electric tea kettles are very good. You need to put water in it though. Today I was supposed to have two calls with two different wedding planners and I emailed them and I hope they got my email because it's supposed to be right now. But I said, we gotta need a reschedule because I am not feeling up for it. Okay, so Theraflu. Dylan, the morning that we were leaving at literally 4 a.m. did a cold plunge. I don't know if I already said that, but literally like he woke up at 3.30 in the morning to do a cold plunge in our bathtub. It was ridiculous. <laughs> and then while my bath is going and while my tea is being broiled when my water's boiling. I'm gonna make a smoothie. These little Nutribullet things, so good. We have our thing. I'm gonna put the bananas in first. Hello? Hey, sweets. Hi, babe. Hey. How are you? So Dylan just called me and yeah, just to check in on me, but I put this in my smoothie also, just to get a little bit of protein. It looks very pretty, and the bath is probably overflowing. And then also my camera's about to die as always, so I'm probably gonna plug that in and take a bath. I just got out of the bath. It was very nice. I wouldn't say I feel better necessarily, but I don't feel worse, so that's good. I think for the rest of the day, I'm just gonna rest and do laundry and just kind of clean up a little bit, maybe. <laughs> we'll see what I have the energy for, but I don't really feel like you guys need to watch me just like be sick and like mope around the house all day, so <laughs> I think I'm gonna end the video here. I love you guys, thank you for watching, and I love you.